Now we go to the presidential race, Republican Donald Trump, who has made a big issue out of illegal immigration from Mexico, paid a visit to the border today, but it did not go exactly as planned. Nancy Cordes was with him in Texas. Trump landed in Laredo and said he was putting his personal safety aside to see the border up close. People are saying, oh, it's so dangerous what you're doing, Mr. Trump. It's so dangerous what you're doing. I have to do it. I have to do it. But his visit didn't last long. A pit stop at a border crossing office followed by a press conference under a tent outside. Have you seen any evidence here to confirm your fears about Mexico sending its criminals across the border? Yes, I have, and I've heard it, and I've heard it from a lot of different people. But he declined to share any details. We'll be showing you the evidence. When? How? When? How? And Laredo's city manager, standing right behind him, panned Trump's proposal to build a wall along the border. We don't think that's uh, necessary at this time. Trump's trip was supposed to involve a tour from leaders of the local Border Patrol Union. But they backed out after Trump implied they were going to endorse him. Because I've been invited by the Border Patrols and they want to honor me, actually. And In a statement, the regional union office said Trump's inflammatory statements about illegal immigration have become a distraction that we cannot afford to have on the border. So Trump had to make do with some quick handshakes and a photo op with local law enforcement officers, and then he was safely back on his plane three hours after he arrived. Before he came here, the GOP frontrunner joked repeatedly that he might not live to return to New York City. But at no point did his life appear to be in any danger. And in fact, Charlie, the murder rate here in Laredo, Texas, is significantly lower than the one in his hometown. Thanks, Nancy.